Hello and welcome to the Zim JavaScript Canvas Framework. We're going to show you some examples of Zim at zimjs.com and I am Dr. Abstract. All right, let's go to the Zim site now and press examples. And we'll scroll down and click on Zong. Ooh, could it be Classic Pong? And this features a leaderboard class that's available in the GameJS helper module for Zim, and that can be found in the code section. All right, we use the arrows to control that one, and W and A, a and D to control the other, A and D. And now I'm just sort of pushing them along. Oh, cool. It also works with gamepad, so you can use uh, joysticks uh, for this. All the different types of joysticks. Oh, it's getting faster. Oh, my goodness. Seems like a pretty fat paddle. Oh, hey, I see what's going on. Now we got to work on oh, two balls. Just barely made that one. Oh, come on. They could have at least kept the same speed. Oh, no, that was so pathetic. I did not at all make the leaderboard. So perhaps you can here at zimjs.com in the examples. And I am Dr. Abstract. Come on into Zim and take a look at the learn section as well as the code section. If you've coded before, take a look at all the new features that we've been adding to the canvas in the code section. And to learn code, uh, there is not a more colorful, um, straightforward, I would say straightforward, consistent way to code and very visual as well. We've been doing this for a long time. We come from a long line of interactive media from director through to flash and now into the canvas. So come on by and have some fun at zimjs.com. I'm Dr. Abstract. Have a great day or night.